How the heck we doing y'all? Today we are checking out this spicy new little indie title called Arcticide. Right now it's just a demo, but this is made by one single guy, developed and published, uh, but hopefully we're picking up a publisher somewhere along the way here. I think this is kind of just a love letter to the game right now. Um, we need a lot more work, I'm not gonna lie, uh, but I think it's really in a cool spot where it is right now. It's a pretty interesting concept. If you guys are uh, salivating at the thought of playing this yourselves, uh, I have the demo link for you below. It's in Steam right now. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna get right on into it, play for about 30 minutes or so. And I think you're gonna like what you see. Let's go ahead and start a new game. We'll do uh, normal difficulty for now. Great. So yeah, the premise of this game, it's it's a lot like Stalker on uh, the way that you fight, the way that you loot. You'll kind of see uh, like Tarkov-esque uh, style fighting and looting here. Uh, yeah, we have a Makarov right now. Uh, the, some of these graphics could definitely use a little bit of work. Uh, I'm not going to hold it against them. You know, it's making graphics is not an easy thing to do. Uh, people don't, you can also like shift click these, can't we? Yeah, we sure can. There you go. Right on in. Wonderful. Uh, so yeah, right now we just have the Makarov. Oh. I keep wanting to get out of menus with escape, but that's not how you do it. Uh, right now we have Makarov. Uh, you can see you have ADS. Looks pretty dang good. Uh, but now we're presented with two choices uh, right here and right here. First choice looks like urban. And the second choice looks like it's going to be the forest. So the idea of this game is to gear up as much as you can for each level and then extract and then do it again. Uh, and then you die, you come back to right here at the start with nothing on you. Same same birthday suit you were born in, uh, for all intents and purposes. But yeah, right now we're in to decide which one we want to go to. I think I'm going to try Urban out. Very good. Yeah, so actually, this is my first time playing it myself. Uh, I've seen some gameplay. I know a little bit about it. Uh, I know there's a crafting, which I think is pretty cool. Uh, I think a lot of healing items uh, you're going to have to get by crafting. Here. Here, we got leans as well. It's looks, looking pretty awesome. Oh, yeah, you just stay on a lean. How do I even out? Okay, shift. <laughs> you press shift, you can even yourself out. Yeah, this kind of itches that Tarkov itch for me, uh, as well as the Stalker one, because, you know, I think Stalker and Tarkov kind of play a lot like each other. Uh, oh, there's a guy down there. Can you see him? I just hit him. I saw his flashlight. I do know we're going to need to take some... Uh, probably longer engagements we got him. You see the red puff of, of mist in the air? That means we freaking smoked him. Yeah, we don't want to get too close to these guys because I think pretty much it's instant death if you if you do. Oh my god! Ooh. Oh my god! Just like in Tarkov, <laughs> I'll just stand there and face dink it until I win, win or lose. Okay, looks like we unlocked ourselves a shotgun. We can decrypt it with that decryption kit, and I'll take the single shot shotgun and I'll put it right in my dang inventory. We also have a zoom. Uh, I think you can throw it on whatever you want. I might just throw it on the pistol. No, I'm gonna throw it on the shotgun. I guess shotgun it is. Uh, right now, we just have this one syringe, and that'll be our usable heal. Uh, we also have some different ammo types as well. I hear someone coming up. I have to press tab, not escape. Where are you? Let me, let me do this lean. And I'm wondering how smart the AI is really going to be. Um, it seemed like they were pretty aggro, uh, from what I could tell. They definitely threw grenades at you, which I think I just heard. Okay, this guy also has a shotgun on him. I think we're going to take it. Take it for the time being. He also has a frag grenade. I absolutely want that. Go put an inventory first and then on four. Yeah, there we are. Heavy FMJs. Let's take a reload. Make sure we're topped off, right? And we can switch to our other gun now, too. <laughs> this is just a shotgun. What am I? What kind of ammo am I shooting? Does it say? I really can't tell, and I might only have one shot, so we'll see how this goes. Um, but yeah, I think right now you can't take out ammo of the guns either. Uh, so that'll just be, you know, a quality of life thing for later on. We can pick up some crowberries, though, which I'm happy to do. I definitely want to get some crafting in if I can. Oh, here's... Okay. <laughs> oh, God. He's lighting me up. There it is. We caught him. I'm going to take one and take a heal. Nice little animation for the heal as well. Looks like we have a broken bone. Um, I don't know if I have anything to deal with that, though. Uh, and this? No ammo for it. Oh my god! No! Where? Run. Pistol, please. Oh my god, from where, bro? Okay, I saw bullets hitting right here, so from over here somewhere. Oh, I see him. Got him. Freaking got him, man. Oh, man, it feels really good. I'm not gonna lie. The combat feels, like, pretty great. 
Did I get two of them? Was there two of these guys? He had a, pers a burst BDW. I think I'm going to take the sod off and chuck it for right now. I don't think I really want it. This looks pretty interesting. I'm going to go ahead and examine that too. I'm wondering if that's like a meta progression thing where you just find out what guns do. I don't know if you can use them until that's been done though. Um, we're also going to toss... Uh... Man, I wish I could inspect this. Oh, I can. Can I throw it on there? Oh, sick. Okay, so our... Our new little uh, SMG is going to be looking real, real nice. I have a good feeling. But yeah, it would be great if I could take the ammo out of here and just throw it into my uh, my other shotgun. But I don't think that's going to be the case. Man, look at this thing, bro. You kidding me? Here, let's take a quick look at our, at our uh, health. Uh, we do have a... Hmm, removes one bleeding, so I can't really do much about that. Uh, we do have a uh, Akavat. Akavit? <laughs> looks like it removes 15 irradiation. Um, looks like this isn't going to help at all with my health. Neither is this. Oh, it's, it's like five health until I combine it with something else. We also have a crafting menu over here, as you can see. So there's a few other things you can uh, craft if you need to. Um, but right now we're uh, in a heap of trouble, it seems. I keep pressing escape. I'm not trying to, I swear. If I go ahead and press N, you guys can see that you got a little uh, Palm Pilot here uh, <laughs> to help you find your way out. Um, you're just really using the coordinates and trying to figure out which way you need to go. So it looks like we kind of have to go this way if I'm looking at the top number. And maybe this way. So I think maybe somewhere over this way. So we're going, you know, about southeast. Southeast looks about right to me. Keep pressing escape. Or press N, get rid of that. And we're just going to try to find our way out. I hear a lot of fighting over there. It'd be cool to loot some good stuff, too. I think I already looted him. Yeah, I sure did. Oh, let me out. Let me out of, let me out of the dang menu, man. All right, we're moving. Yeah, you also notice on the bottom left, we have a bunch of uh, vitals. We have to make sure we're taken care of as well. That's where my broken bone currently is slated. Uh, oh, my God. Oh, oh, that thing kicks, man. I think I got him. I think I destroyed him. Oh, wait, no, he's alive. It's a burst. So you really got to bring that sucker down as soon as you start firing. He uses a lot of ammo, too. I'm, like, scared to hip fire this thing, honestly. I think we're good right here. I'm going to go and take a quick peek. He's got some buckshot on him. I think he'll take his gun for the time being, too, because you never know. We have some buckshot now, so it's at least some other ammo. As far as I can tell, there's a lot of uh, looting that needs to be done in this game if you want to make it anywhere. But yeah, I'm, I'm really hoping that a publisher can pick this up because I'd love to see some polish on this thing, man. It's it's a really, really cool concept. Um, you know, just roguelikes in general, I think, are you know, just taken off in popularity so much in the past few years. Uh, and, you know, the stalker claim to fame is... Uh... Oh, I can try... Oh, I did it. I did it. <laughs> the stalker claim to fame is... Uh... Enough of a reason on, on its own to um, to warrant, like, another game like it, right? Okay, so that's one area completed. So I, I would love to see some other objectives and stuff we could do, too. Maybe, like, oh, some meta progression inside of, like, a like vis-a-vis -a, -vis a base. I think it might be kind of sweet. Um, just to kind of bring in some more of that, like, Escape from Tarkov kind of a, you know, dopamine hit. You know, <laughs> it's really nice to bring things back to your base. And then uh, maybe the meta progression also continues that way. But yeah, the roguelike nature of this is, like, just so cool to me. I haven't seen too many FPS roguelikes uh, that I would consider playing. Um, just because, I don't know, the setting. I think the setting has a lot to do with it. And a setting like this is pretty sweet. And it's actually kind of getting me, uh, it's getting, getting my taste buds going for some uh, Road to Vostok in the future, too. Because, like, it, it's kind of making me think it might be kind of similar to what I was already describing with the base. Alright, but for now... I'm going to pick up some more crowberries. We're going to be just absolutely flush with them. Let me pull up my little palm pilot here. Where are we at? Oh, 
Oh, my other distance has disappeared. I don't know what that means for me. Is there only one way out? Durability on this gun is getting pretty low, too. Gotta be careful. So I have a feeling this thing is gonna jam the next time we fire it. Just making sure that. We oh, oh! Behind me. Oh my god, this guy's red, bro. Hold on, we got him. We got this. Right here. No! <laughs> Was that guy a boss? Oh my god. Jeez. <laughs> it scared the crap out. He came right through the dang rock, man. Yeah, things like that. You know, it's early access. It's a demo. It's it's going to happen, right? I think we have enough time to go ahead and do another one. Uh, maybe we'll... Yeah, I think we'll just keep it on normal. I think normal is fine. I was going to say maybe easy, but at the same time... Um, I think normal is probably the difficulty that things are supposed to be scaled to at the moment, right? So here we'll take our sleeping bag. We do get to sleep in this game. Uh, we have the emery we didn't use last time. We can uh, do shift click for these. I've got to remember that. There we are. We'll go and throw this on three. I think we're good to go again. Let's see what we, should, what we got this time. We got the forest. We got urban. I think I'm taking forest this time. I haven't seen forest yet. All right, in we go. Oh, <laughs> it looks like the rest of the map hasn't been uh, completed as of yet. Once again, well, I'm not going to hold that against him. Uh, I think the core gameplay loop is uh, is enough to uh, recommend some rewards for this guy because it's pretty freaking sweet, right? What you got here? Some yarrow, some yarrow root, yarrow flower. Remember that being an item in uh, Divinity Sin, or Divinity Original Sin, uh, two. You had to give it to this crazy guy who goes freaking berserk if you don't. Actually, he still might go berserk if I remember correctly, but... Battery just dies. There we are. Alright. Be real careful. Oh, right here. Right here. I have this really big problem with pistols, man. I have to, like... Shoot, and then look away, and then go back on to make sure I'm actually on them. <laughs> Those sights are doing nothing for me. Oh! I see the light. Oh. Oh, no, man. Oh, we got messed up. <laughs> Here, that's plus three. We can use that syringe. See that cool animation one more time? Yeah, we are going to be hurting for some... Oh, machine... I just heard footsteps, bro. Dude, this game's got my heart pumping. It has, like, that eerie, like... You know, whatever whatever sound effect in the in the back or in the background that's like really creeping me out. All right, we killed this fool too. Got absolutely spent, bud. Mess with the best. This is what you get. Okay, we got some buckshots. We got playing cards. Low tech entertainment. I guess there might be entertainment in this game <laughs> at some point, or maybe they're just looking for something to throw onto the uh, old description there. I could be taking it uh, a little a little out of context. But I, I was I was able to throw this uh, this cool little uh, suppressor on here for now, which will be kind of sick. So everything sounds a lot better when it's suppressed, right? Like the rule of cool is like reign supreme on that one for sure. Yeah, let's move forward. I do kind of want to check out this machine pistol though. Here, let's go ahead and uh, can I can I use it without it? Let's see. I can pull it out. Weapon is encrypted. Okay, so you do need to do this. In fact, there we go. That looks like it's gonna be pretty sick. <laughs> Man, I'm kind of kind of thinking maybe we should have here. Let's let's go and use some duct tape on this. So we can uh, repair the durability a little bit. The suppressor on this would have been much cooler. <laughs> it's gotta be said. I might have jumped the gun. Uh, pardon the pun, and the rhyme. All right, let's see what we got here. I love to just blow someone away with this thing before I die. Man, oh my god. Oh, I see. Oh, there's two! There's three! There's three of them! <laughs> oh my god, bro. Dude was tossing nades over. Oh god. Are they gonna rush me? I'm shooting him through the fence. Got one. I've got I have six shots. Where you at? 
I don't want to step in that whatever that purple mist is, man. No, thank you. I just... Oh, my God. Okay, I'm out of ammo. Let's swap to our... Oh, no, no. I ran out of everything, man. <laughs> so freaking be it. All right, sweet y'all. I think we're going to call it right there. I think right there and as good a spot as any. You can see for yourself that this game is going to be amazing. Uh, I, have, I have really high hopes for this. Uh, even if you don't want to buy the game um, later on, just, you know, wishlist it. Wishlist it for now because, you know, people that make cool stuff deserve to, you know, have their work recognized. Uh, so the demo is free. Uh, so you really have nothing to lose either way. Make sure you wishlist it. Make sure you download the demo. Give it a ride. See what you think. Let me know. All right, y'all. That is it for me for right now. I'll catch you on the next video. Take care and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.